When you step into your fears and continue to push yourself to go on, something happens for you. It will enable you to transcend yourself. If you don't develop the courage to do that which has been given you to do, and you spend a lot of time going around trying to convince other people or trying to get their approval, what will happen is that you will lose your nerve and other people will convince you that what you're doing doesn't have any value and you'll give up on your dream. Do not go where the path may lead, but go where there's no path and leave a trail. Stop living your life like you have a thousand years to live. In life, you're either here today and you're gone today. If there's something that you want to do and you can't do it all at one time, do just a little bit of it. A friend of mine, Bobby Kerr, used to be a roommate. Bobby wanted to go into the area of public relations. He loved working with the public. Young lady he wanted to marry named Clarice. Bobby was a great procrastinator. Pretty soon the job where Bobby worked, they transferred him to another location. He went out to celebrate with the people on that new job site. And Bobby suffered a massive heart attack and died. Bobby didn't drink and didn't smoke, was under 40, and he died. Ask your question, how much time do you have left? How much time do you have left? When you start thinking about that, we don't know. We don't know. Bobby took all the greatness and all of the talent and all of his abilities to his grave with him. Stop wasting valuable time. Knowing that if we begin to live our lives as if each day were our last, our lives will take off take on a whole new meaning. Most of us don't use the stuff that we have brought into the universe.